Om Shanti, welcome back to your own channel. Seek the soul that truth lies within, and we're going to talk about 21st of April, today's blessing, where Supreme God Father wants us to become a powerful soul and finish all the complaints in our life with all the powers and become complete. Any person who is not complete from within as a soul has complaints in their lives with people, with themselves, and with the world. Let's explore this, how to finish this complaining attitude. <coughs> so God says, May you be a powerful soul who finishes all complaints with all powers and becomes complete. These are the spiritual powers which we attain when we learn the Rajya meditation. We get to know that we souls have got hidden powers which we can use in any situation in, person, in front of any person and find a method to bring the situation in our control. And then we also learn how to become complete. So God says, if you have any weaknesses in you, weaknesses generally are related to finding faults in others, finding out what is not good in this world, what is bad in the self, what is bad in the family, what is bad in the job where they are working, what is not good in the business, or what is not good in relations. So when we have that habit, that's a weakness within us, that we can't look at the brighter side of people, but we generally tend to find out faults. And if anything goes bad, it's their fault. So we have this kind of weakness within us, and we try to cover up everything. We try to hide our faults, by giving logical answers, by finding out why and what the other person could have done so that this situation did not come. That's a weakness within us actually. <coughs> so God says, if you have any weaknesses in you, then understand the cause of them and find a solution to it because it is Maya's system that whatever you are weak in, that weakness will not allow you to be a conqueror of Maya. Now, this weakness could be laziness. This weakness could be that we ourselves have got certain lazy behaviors, but we blame other people for not being disciplined. We blame other people for not allowing us to move ahead in our life. And that is our own weakness, but we are putting it onto others. That is, we are giving reasons for that weakness to stay within us. Maya will take benefit from your weakness and will deceive you in the end with that particular weakness. <coughs> what that means is, when the time comes to achieve success in any kind of work, even a small work, it could be a day's work, it could be a month's work, it could be a year's work, but that weakness within us will come and become a hurdle for us to move ahead in our life and will not allow us to finish that work that very day or that very month or that very year. Why? Because we'll be spending our time in blaming, in complaining of what and how and where it could have been done better. So then God says, Therefore, accumulate a stock of all the powers. Now these powers help us to face situation face our own weaknesses, tolerate situations, tolerate people, accommodate different kind of souls with different habits, different ways of thinking, and still go ahead and get the team going and getting the work done. So these are the powers which are very crucial. Therefore accumulate a stock of all powers and become a powerful soul. So in a house, a father, a mother will need these powers. In a Business. The businessman will need these powers to get the work done. In a job, the CEO, the director, the manager will need these powers so as to get the team together, even amongst differences, and get the work done. So, by experimenting with the yoga, that is the meditation, finish all complaints and become complete. Remember the slogan, if not now, then never if you don't do it now 
than never. Why never? Because as we age, our habits become very strong within and then it becomes difficult to even see our own weaknesses. For some people, they are on the deathbed and they still don't accept that they have a habit of looking at other people's weaknesses or they have a habit of complaining and finding faults in others for their own work not getting done and this becomes a habit and we take it to the next life or the next birth to this very habit so God says it's now or never so with this Om Shanti